13 things women think guys want in bed, but they don't. Stop thinking about all the sex stuff you need to be doing, and just have sex. 1. The move. Making a ton of noise when you orgasm. What guys think, sex noises, and dirty talk, can be enjoyable, but it's important to concentrate on your orgasm rather than on making noise. Some women become quieter just before climax, while others prefer to yell. Do whatever feels right for you, not what you think is expected. 2. The move, talking in an itsy bitsy baby voice the whole time. What guys think, I absolutely never want to hear the baby voice during sex. To be honest, I don't ever want to hear it, but it's especially off-putting during intimate moments. Just consider the situation, you're pretending to be a baby while someone is having sex with you. Is this really something people do? 3. The move, deep throating. What guys think, deep throating can be enjoyable, but you'd be amazed at what you can achieve with just your hands and the tip in your mouth. Hint, it can result in a lot of semen. You can stimulate ejaculation using only your hands and the tip. 4. The move, for us to have like 8 hands and be able to turn into a human sex carnival. What guys think, while guys might fantasize about wild, adventurous sex, it's a common topic when we gather over beers and sports, never do anything that makes you physically uncomfortable. It's essential for both partners to prioritize the actual act of intercourse. If you can't balance on one hand and reach behind to tickle our balls during doggy style, that's perfectly fine. We prefer having great sex over risking both of us face planting from attempting an advanced move. 5. The move, saying his name over and over again. What guys think, once or twice is plenty, and while it's not necessary, it can be incredibly sexy. Just avoid repeating it too often, or we might feel like we're stuck in a time loop. 6. The move, keeping your eyes closed the whole time even though you kind of want to see what's going on. What guys think, I understand that constant, unbroken eye contact can be uncomfortable for some, but keeping your eyes closed the entire time feels even stranger. It suggests either A, you don't want to look at us or B, your mind is somewhere, or with someone, else entirely. 7. The move, putting on complex lingerie every time sex happens. What guys think, I don't think guys are surprised when you end up wearing granny panties because you forgot to do laundry. You definitely don't always need to wear sexy underwear. Or any underwear at all. It's just another layer for us to fumble with while we're trying to get you naked. 8. The move, pulling his hair to show how into it you are. What guys think, we often have really short hair, which can be a bit of a downside. While I can't speak for every guy, some do like it, there are many ways to show you're enjoying yourself. Honestly, if we're doing a good job, you won't even have to think about it your enjoyment will come naturally. 9. The move, just laying there while he takes control of the situation. What guys think, do what feels right for you. Taking control can be incredibly sexy, but don't force it if it doesn't feel natural. It's like trying to fly a 747 to orgasm town without knowing how to pilot a plane. 10. The move, acting like you've never done any of this before. What guys think, this can be thrilling, but it can also put a lot of pressure on us. Just be honest. In the heat of the moment, having a few well-practiced moves is definitely hot. 11. The move, kneading your hair and makeup to look perfect afterwards. What guys think, bedhead is sexy. I hope no one frets about their hair getting messy during sex. That sounds, dull. 12. The move, not caring if you didn't orgasm. What guys think, any guy who's even remotely good in bed will ensure you have your pleasure. If he's skilled, 
he'll prioritize your orgasm first. If not, then he's simply not satisfying. Note that difficulty and inability to orgasm are distinct, achieving orgasm isn't effortless for everyone, but he should be making the effort. 13. The move, never speaking up if you don't like something. What guys think, not every man desires to be told what to do, but it's important not to stay silent if something isn't working. He won't object if you guide him toward helping you achieve orgasm. If you enjoyed watching this video don't forget to like subscribe and turn on the notification bell, so you don't miss any new videos. Let us know your thoughts about this video in the comments section down below and feel free to stay and enjoy it until the end, also make sure to check out our next highlighted video and we will see you next time. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.